Hello, Dony Kebab here. How are you doing, guys? Um, I'm just here by myself today because I wanted to show you a quick tutorial on how to set up profiles on your Minecraft uh, Minecraft launcher, on the new launcher. Uh, I'm doing this on Mac, but it's the same on PC. I believe it's pretty much the same launcher in Java. So I was just going to quickly show you how to do this because it took me a little while to work out. So figured I would show you if you guys can read that I've basically got a whole bunch of different profiles here that I've put in for playing different maps playing snapshots latest version and uh, you can do rollback really really easily in this so if you remember doing it before it was a bit of a hassle but this is nice and easy and it means you don't end up with a sketchy minecraft jar hopefully so what we do is uh, I'm going to show you this screen because it's a little less white than the other screen so basically I've done them all here but what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to do it so to do the latest version, you can pretty much just play it, it's fine, you don't need a profile, it just does it, but I'm going to show you anyway what to do. So we go latest version, automatic, uh, blah blah blah, that's all fine, leave all of this, you can change these if you like, but obviously don't need to. Uh, use latest version, click use latest version and then hit save profile. And then when you select that, latest version and hit play it will hopefully play the right version. Let me just check. And there we have it. 1.6.2. Excellent. So there you go. As you saw, that was uh, the latest version. So um, now we are back in Minecraft again. So I'm going to show you how to do another profile to do a snapshot. So to run a snapshot or run just snapshots. So if we call this one snapshots um, again this is all fine and then what you do here is you go enable experimental development versions okay snapshots it asks you a question if you're sure you want to go ahead with that uh, it mentions the backups you may corrupt your backups so make sure you make a backup of your save files in advance but then you click yes here um, you can actually even have like seriously old ones if you want like you can let me just cancel that actually. I don't want that. Go away. Um, but yeah, you can have like the really old ones, Alpha and Beta, which is kind of fun. So you could always roll back right back to them. But I will show you how to roll back in a moment. So we go Save Profile. This is our Snapshots one. So we go Snapshots. We click the magic play button. And let's see what happens. Looks like we're downloading the latest snapshot, which is cool. I'll probably fast forward that for you. And there we have it. Minecraft 13W36B, which is the latest snapshot. So if I quit this again, and I will take you back to the start and show you the next one. Hello, we're back. Let's show you now. I'm going to show you how to uh, roll back your version, basically. So to roll back your version, you go new profile here. Um, I don't know. Let's call it like, I don't know, old school. But like, oh, that's good spelling, isn't it? Old school! Um, again here, we probably, well, you could actually have anything you want in here. So say we wanted to roll back, like, seriously far. Um, these versions are unstable, just a warning again. Uh, allow alpha, again, a warning that they might be unstable. But what this does is now we can then select anything we want so we can go super old school remember these betas you remember the first ones with like the dogs and the alphas i've never even played some of these like look at that you can genuinely play like some of the first minecraft alphas that's brilliant so anyway that is your nostalgia for you but bearing in mind some puzzle maps adventure maps might require slightly older versions like 1.4.6 for example uh, to play certain maps, like we did a stream uh, recently of Adventure Time with Finn and Jake, and we had to run 1.4.6 or 0.7 for the texture pack to work. So just bear that in mind. That's this is basically how you do it. So I'm going to run old school beta Minecraft just because. Do you guys remember the original? It was a different load screen, wasn't it? I just want to see 1.3. So yeah, so. You do that, and then we rock on a bit of old school Minecraft, and we press this button, see what it does. Yeah, it looks like we're downloading some files. 
And look at that beautiful background. Wow, do you remember this, guys? This is genius. Old school. Multiplayer, single player. Love it. Oh my goodness, this is so old school. Mods and texture packs, remember that? Goodness. Options. Oh, there's like three options. It's brilliant. Okay. Here we go, and back again. So that is pretty much what we do. And um, if you want to edit your profiles, if you go to up the top here, um, profile editor, you can actually go through and um, and just right click and delete them. Or you can copy them, or you can duplicate them. So you've got a super old school. So we'll just clear this out a little bit, delete that one. Uh, official Minecraft, I like to call it, latest version. So yeah, these are obviously really old school ones, so you can just delete that. And I think from here, you can just double click to to load it up. Oh no, to edit it, you just, yeah, just double click it if you want to edit it, if you want to change. So this one might be quite cool to have the older ones enabled, so you can always just save that. You know what I mean? Latest version, save. So again, like that's just going to update every time now, you see, so it's perfect. And you can select them all from here. So anyway, guys, good luck with that. And I hope you have fun uh, rolling back and playing the snapshots. And um, look out for our video on how to host a server, which should be coming up soon. So yeah, thank you, guys. Bye-bye.